The music, all of which she writes, arranges, and sings, as, as you know, to her own accompaniment, has been called rock, uh, jazz, and soul, I guess, are the three elements that cover it. Two of her works, by the way, have been recorded by a popular group, The Fifth Dimension. And both of these pieces, uh, Stoned Soul Picnic and Sweet Blindness, indicate that her music is beginning to reach larger audiences. Now, Miss Nero discusses her work with William Cloman, freelance writer for Esquire magazine and the Sunday New York Times. It, it just 
can penetrate you, you know, it just penetrate a human being, you know, and uh, uh, it's also, it also um, kind of uh, has, has to do with your communication with people after that, you know, you, you, I think that you understand more, you know, because uh, I really feel that, you know, pain can do those two things, you know. And if you're creating or if your work involves the openness to the experience to ever find that this is a difficulty that you seek certain kinds of experience in order to create something from them? Um, I mean, it's, it's a well, strange question to ask an artist, but that's... Yeah. I suppose that, that it's a little bit of that, you know. It's a little bit of that. Because, like, sometimes, you know, like, um, if I meet a man or something who's very groovy, I say, oh, he's very good material. <laughs> <laughs> and it's terrible. That sounds terrible. But, but uh, you know, but... Uh, <laughs> um, you know, but I... But, it's, but it's a natural thing, you know. It is, I, I reflect, you know. I reflect on, on, uh, you know, and things, you know, and, and what I feel, you know. I, it's the most honest part of me. And what about influences? Not influences, but so much people who maybe see the world the same way you do. Are there people that you like learn to see the world through when you were a child? Well, I, I, I'm sure that, you know, that I see the world through, you know, through, through my eyes and it's, uh, it's, um, uh, I think that I see things differently than most people. I think so, you know, because like, you know, like, um, I'm, uh, you know, like I remember in school, you know, I hated school and, and when the teacher, like, uh, she used to talk to me. I wouldn't really be hearing what she was saying, but I would be looking into her eyes and trying to, you know, and, and getting into a sensory thing, you know, and... And seeing the world through your senses. Yeah, yeah. Right, yeah. Yeah. Thank you. You're welcome.